Yes. Hey y'all, hey. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the video, Love Bugs. It is your host, Cole. Lama said it. And we are back, y'all, for another YouTube reaction video. Ciao. I mean, girl, I don't even know where the heck the video came from. Heck no. Let's go back here and see if we can get it. No, and it still didn't pop up. What in the whole crap? I got to go and find this video, y'all. Hold on. Um, I was <laughs> just turned on dang on TikTok. And we got Peach McIntyre walking around dang on Walmart with her hair. Oh, here it is. Peach McIntyre walking around dang on Walmart with her hair looking absolutely ratchet and crazy, y'all. For reals. So I guess it's 11 o'clock and <laughs> the girl told Peach that the, I, I'm going to just let y'all watch it because I was like, what is going on here? And then when I seen Peach hair, I'm like, oh, hell no. This cannot be a representation of, <laughs> of who? Because not that she's in Walmart looking like this. Mm. Ah, y'all, I, I just, I can't. Let me hit the screen share. I'm going to let y'all see what the heck I'm talking about. Because this is a freaking mess. So Peach Fed, I'm literally in line at Walmart, right? in line she said that the registers automatically go off at 11 so like even though i've been standing in this line before 11 they registers automatically stop working at 11 and that she can't check my stuff out i'm like what like what am i supposed to do She's look at peach hair she in walmart like this I can't use such a <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I wasn't even gonna go live. I promise y'all I was not going live. But I'm like, you know what? I'm not even about to take the time to do a pre-recorded reaction. Let me just go live and pop my stuff real quick because Peach McIntyre. No, God don't go well. She is a mess up in Walmart. I don't care what time of the day it is. There is no reason for you to have left out of your home looking like that, knowing that your children go to public school, sis. Your kids got to be seen in school every day, all day, and wonder why your dang old oldest son wanted to drop out last year. I would drop out of school also if my mother was walking around out in public looking like this with half of no clothes on, embarrassing me and my siblings and my father. This is out of pocket. There is, I don't care how confident you claim you are within yourself. There is no reason for you to walk outside looking like this. This truly says that you are insecure. You claim my life in order. I got it in order. Y'all take some classes from me. I can teach you how to get your life in order. You can't teach me a damn thing walking outside looking like this. And you don't see millionaires walking outside looking like this. All your quote unquote millionaire friends that you got, the ones that you taught how to make their money, they not walking outside looking like this. So what are you saying? Hey, child, bye. Let's finish watching the video because it's not over. Florida is getting sick and tired of Peach McIntyre. And this is proof. Check out. So even though I've been in this line, I had, no, I was already standing right here. I didn't just walk up. This is crazy. So she lying. They just cut their register off at 11. Just lying. Yeah, I'm just going to leave this stuff right here. I swear, every day I get tested. Every single fucking day I get tested. Every day. That's why your hair ugly. Every day. I'm going to say the registers automatically closed. Down. It's like, God, what do you want from me? Nah, she, she's in Walmart. Look, look at like this. 
she in Walmart looking like this right here and going to tell the lady her hair is ugly. Going to say that every single day God is testing her. Well, Peach McIntyre, if this was a test, trust and believe me, you failed. You failed. You you failed, sis. They told you they could not check you out. You making sure that you said fucking while that little girl was crossing your path so she heard you? You failed. You walking past the lady and saying your hair is ugly? You failed the test, sis. I'm... Do the reaction even need to go any further? And then on top of you saying that she was lying and we know that you are the habitual liar. I mean, do we need to go any further? The other lady walked up and said, no, I seen you standing over there. So Peach McIntyre went from the self-checkout over to the register to try to get rang up real quick instead of just staying in the self-checkout. Now she can't get rang up at all. Then she made sure she cursed aggressively while that little girl was walking in front of her and then told the lady her hair was ugly all while you looking like this and want to say every day God is testing you. Okay. All right. Do you want me to save money? That had to be what it is because I didn't need those picture frames. I came in here for some formula for my baby and... Every day I get tested. This will literally be my last time ever shopping at Walmart. Last time. I'm about to go to Walgreens and get some formula and get some. Trust me, Walmart will not cry that you're not coming back. They won't. Popeyes, trust past your dumb ass. So do you really think? That Walmart's going to cry that you won't come back. And trust me, Walgreens and Target don't want you either. JCPenney's, TJ Maxx, don't none of these stores want your kind. And trust, this has nothing to do with the, the this. It got all to do with what the fuck going on on your head. The personality that's flowing within your motherfucking body talking about that. And then want to keep talking about God testing you. Bitch, you failed. You goddamn failed, bitch. You didn't fail. You failed at the motherfucking test at Popeyes, which you walking out of the fucking Popeyes yelling, acting all fucking ghetto and reckless and shit like you came from some Florida trailer park talking about some, who cooked this? Don't ever come back to this Popeyes and they fucking trespass your stupid ass and you want to sit there and cry about it? Bitch, you have failed every test that the Lord has given you. How many more? Girl, bye. Your man cheated. You still, you failed that test too. You failed that test too. That was a test to see your loyalty, see how strong you are, see how much you love your goddamn self. And you failed that too. Girl, bye. Girl, bye. He tested you. Your goddamn 14-year-old son came and said he wanted to drop out of school. That was a test. You failed that shit too. Come on now, Peach McIntyre, for real, for real. You can stop trying to feed everybody this foolery. Anybody that give you a dime, a dollar thirty-five, a ninety-nine cent, or anything is an absolute fool. Because ain't no fucking way you don't support anyone. You don't support your local community. You don't support single moms. So there's no reason for people to feel like, oh well, she's a good person, so I'll still just support her. Even if she got a bad attitude, she's a good person, so I support her. Now this bitch don't support nobody. Nothing that matters. So no, nah, hell no, nah, this is out of control. Told that lady her hair was ugly. Her hair looked damn better than yours. She's at work working. If you brought your ass in work looking like that, bitch, you should have been wrote the fuck up. The hell? Oh, this is a disgusting mess. I I laughed so hard. But your hair ugly. She should have said, <laughs> your mama, the fuck? Your mama, then Peach would have turned around and been hollering and recording and, oh, let me talk to your manager. And what the manager, bitch, they should trespass her from Walmart too. Hashtag Walmart. Hashtag trespass Peach McIntyre. Water. <clears throat> Dead serious. And I won't lie, I'm pissed off. But I ain't even mad at her. She pissed off. <laughs>
I'm mad at me. This is why I don't need to shop at Walmart. I fucking hate Walmart for this particular reason. I don't even know why I parked it. Poor thing. All right, here yeah, I'm at Gregory's car. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I am so mad. Ooh. And I know that wasn't nice to sell that lady her hair ugly. Mm -hmm. Especially with my hair look like this. I'm so mad. Let's go to all greens. She mad because Wood gone somewhere running the fucking streets slinging ding a ling to Tom, 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 what, Tom Rika, Tiffanyka, and Ashalika. Okay. <laughs> I had to get the names correct real quick. She singing dingling to every last one of them. That's why she's in her son's car and she's out in the public looking goddamn crazy. I'm trying to figure out your husband is so good and you be thanking the Lord. She said, good morning, Lord. I know we did this yesterday, but we'll do it today also. I just want to thank you for having Wood actually at home right now and him actually slinging dingling to me. He wakes up, wakes up in the morning. He gets our children dressed, Lord, and he even drops them off at work, Lord. I would like to thank you for having the bare minimum of a goddamn husband I could ever fucking possibly have, Lord. Thank you very much for giving them to me, Lord. I waited years on years on probably 18 years for this man to not do a goddamn thing still, Lord, but I would like to thank you. There you go, Peach McIntyre. Like, come on now, sis. Get it together. Where is he at? Make him, where, where's Wood? Hmm. Where is Wood? Why are you not in Wood's truck? Why did Wood not go to the store and get the goddamn formula? As a matter of fact, he's already out and about. So why didn't you call Wood 45 minutes before Walmart was about to close and tell him to get the damn formula in the water? He already out there tricking and digging. He could have just slid his little penis out a little bit early, said, bitch, I got to go get my baby some milk. You understand how this go. And left. Get the milk and come home. You out there looking crazy in your son's car. We know why you mad up in there telling that lady her hair is ugly. Child bye. Peach is mad because wood is going, y'all. Mm -mm. That's a damn shame. Okay, so if y'all did not see Peach McIntyre then got her ass <laughs> banned in trespass from Popeyes, I said, this got to be the dumbest bitch ever. Dumb, dumb, diddy, dumb, dumb. Okay, y'all see the shirt she got on right there? Let's see if I can go and find this first Popeye's video real quick to show y'all what the hell she did in Popeye's to get herself banned. Um, what? She wear this shirt a lot. God dang. She got it on again here. What? Peach. Girl, you the big bag, big bank. Ain't no, I don't see your millionaire friends wearing the same damn clothes like that all the time. Shit, she wear that shirt too much. Um, let me find this dang on video, y'all. Yo, that wasn't even the point of me strolling, but shoes. She wore the damn shirt four times in the last month, four different days. Let's see, it's a lot of shit on this channel. Um. Jeez Louise. I'm about tired of looking. I'ma just give up. Y'all, y'all cheer me on. Say don't give up, Bly. You can do it. Don't don't give up, Bly. You can you can do it. Don't give up. Don't give up, Bly. Don't don't give up. I just want to show y'all what she did to get <laughs> trespassed from Popeyes. If we could find it. Jeez Louise. Okay, Peach. They say consistency. Consistency. As you see, y'all, we, we are getting exhausted flowing through Peach McIntyre's TikTok looking for the dang on video. Consistency pays off, honey. Boom, boom. <sighs> if it's not nothing, the girl is consistent. All right, y'all. I'm 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 really about to give up. I'm I'm trying. Try not to give up. Y'all say, don't give up. Blah, don't give up. Blah, don't. Oh, here we go. Okay, I didn't give up. Child, help me, please. I, I damn near quit. It, it was going down. Come on. Hurry up. I know we didn't got way down far. Here. All right, let's see this. This hey, Popeyes better count. They motherfucking days. Look at this chicken they gave us. 
some of it's still pink. I'm sure finna take this back. This is 16 piece. Show finna take it back. Look at the macaroni. Macaroni look older than me. Look at this. Look at that. Now, trust, we're not saying she's wrong for taking the food back. But this is what led up to Peach McIntyre being trespassed from Popeyes <laughs> and the police being called. Count how they count. Look at this. Don't even got the timestamp underneath. I know this macaroni came from earlier today. It's 6 o'clock at night. Well, 551. You gotta go back to Popeyes in the rain. Thank goodness it ain't raining too hard. I ain't had no business coming to this Popeyes, anyways. Everybody in Hillsborough County know this is the worst Popeyes in the Hillsborough County area. I'm so mad about these damn chicken. Let me calm down because I don't want to have to look if they book. <laughs> <laughs> Chicken is old and this macaroni is burnt. Um, I had a 16 piece for my chicken that they gave me. They ain't give me no receipt. Special, they said it's about, I think, five minutes on mild chicken and eight minutes on macaroni. So we're going to wait. Um, my husband said I should just get my money back, but they didn't give me a receipt and I don't feel like going through that. I had got a six piece family meal, three macaronis and one mashed potatoes. The only thing that was good was the mashed potatoes. Like that was the only thing that didn't have a problem. All right, Peach Bash. So here is the new order. We're gonna check it out. Oh, so we're gonna check it out before we leave. Somebody else bring the chicken back. I just think they don't know how to cook chicken at this location, y'all. They just, they just don't know what the fuck they doing. Y'all don't know how to fry no chicken here and crispy. Who the fuck cooking this? Y'all need a new cook. Y'all hear her? She's standing inside of Popeye's right now recording. And she just yelled, who the fuck cooking this? Y'all need a new cook. Same shirt on. This is crazy, y'all. Y'all need a new cook. Whoever cooking this need to get fired. Y'all chicken look so look at this shit. Give me my money back. I don't know how we're gonna get it back. I ordered uh with Apple Pay through the drive through. I ordered a 16 I don't know who the fuck cooking this, y'all. This is supposed to be fresh chicken, y'all. They just cooked this. I literally waited in here for about 25 minutes. But it's now her chicken is messed up. But it's her response. Mm -mm -mm. And her chicken look just like it. We don't appreciate this. This ain't KFC the fuck who cooking it. What the hell? I want to them. Peach Batch, we're going to go to Popeye's in Sun City. I did not want to go to Sun City because Sun City Popeye's got a long line and always a long way. But they chicken be fresh and they be crispy and it just be a good this Popeye. I see why this location was shut down last year. Y'all shouldn't reopen this motherfucker. So Peach Patch, look at her chicken and she just walked in the door to bring back too. They playing Popeyes. Popeyes. The fuck? Listen, we either need to shut this location down or we need to send the people from Sun City over here to teach them how to fry chicken. No, I pay with Apple Pay. Look, she said at least show them that I gave you some extra stuff. She gave me some strawberries. But the cook ain't cooking. Baby, we need us to fell and fresh out of the penitentiary to cook this or something, baby. They said it's a new cook. It's a new cook. We need an old one to, to get back there. Call them. Y'all losing money, Popeye. I don't know if this franchise or corporate. Y'all losing money. Where's Popeye's in Hillsborough County? Everybody know that. Even on Facebook. I'll post a picture of the chicken. Everybody on Facebook say, hey, I got chicken from there earlier on 301, and it was nasty. I had to take that shit. So this has been happening to y'all all day. All right, Peach Patch, they gave me back this. They're going to put my stuff back on my card. They said they refunded it. It was $64.59. Mind y'all, I just returned the 16 piece. The new one they gave me, I gave back again. So that's 32 pieces of chicken going down the drain. If y'all don't shut this motherfucker down, they cannot cook. And I love Popeye. I fire everybody in there. I'm like, to the manager, if the new cook can't cook,
And that's how she screamed on the way out of Pie Pies. Child. Oh, get your ass back there and make the chicken all crispy. That other lady ain't never turning her chicken right now. Y'all have people returning chicken. I must get back to the dang on. Child, I don't even know. Child, I don't even. Do they take me to the top? No. <laughs> I try to skip to the top real quick. How I'm going to do it, child? It was too many videos we had to stroll through. Dang. Let's get back to the top real quick so we can uh, watch what's going on with her and Popeye's right now, as in currently, y'all, child. That was on February the 17th, y'all. She went to Popeye's. Um, and then she went to Popeye's again, what, two days ago? And uh, this happened. Y'all see the police? Child by. Child by. She went to Popeye's two days ago or something like, and this what happened. Y'all hit the likey like button. Peach is a damn mess. Play. She. So you say I'm trespassed from Popeye's. What about that? Well, the papers is 911. I call them. Call them. Call the police. Tell me. Call the. Call the police. Tell me. Nobody. Nobody has told me I'm trespassed from Popeyes. This man literally just came out. I'm in the drive through at Popeyes. Somebody, I'm trespassed. Call him. Call him. Now I'm literally finna sit here and wait on the police. These are the tests. How the hell is she back at Popeyes less than a month later with the same shirt on? Back at the same Popeyes that she just hollered and hooped it at. And acted a damn fool. She really went back there. Girl. Test that I talk about. Girl. Like pictures. What would you benefit from waiting on the police? They fool already be nasty. One second, I'll be right with you. Okay. But we're gonna wait on the police to come trespass me. We're gonna sit here and wait. Are you gonna trespass me too? Are you me? We're gonna sit here and wait. Mind y'all, I literally just got here. Gregory McKay came and got some food from Popeye's at the school, and I just came to pick him up. I went to Buffalo Wild Wings. Then I said, oh, my goodness, I ain't get trust name. Trust like Popeye's. Might as well come here. Well, now nice one. Right? The manager just going to walk out to the drive through I, I ain't cussed at him or nothing. I ain't did nothing to him. Just literally sitting on drive through and going to tell me I've been trespassed. <laughs> from Popeyes. I'm going to sit here and wait for the police because I'm going to sue Popeyes. Because what did I do? You can't tell me I've been trespassed from Popeyes and I've never sat in front of a police officer who said you're trespassed from Popeyes. You don't own Popeyes. So I'll sit here. Child, yeah. He told me to wait a moment for my order. So we're going to see if they let me order something. But if not, I'm going to sit right here and drive through and wait for the police. I was just in there. Let me go ahead and throw my hand part. Why would she just sit in the drive through and block everybody else from ordering? And after she has been notified that she cannot place the order and she is trespassed from Popeyes. This is how ignorant she is. I enjoy my Buffalo Wild Wings. So Peach Patch, I'm literally still in the line at Popeyes, right? I got my buffalo wild wings. I'm gonna eat my chicken. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna eat my chicken. That's my celery. Like right, they gave me all drums. She is she gonna sit in the drive through while waiting for the police and eat her food? Like I can't with how ratchet she is. I get it, but he actually came and told you that you are trespassed. So if you really want to sit there and wait forever, then move to the side a little bit so people can place their order because you see they're not letting you place an order and wait for the police. She's so freaking ghetto. It is just, it's out of control. It's really out of control. They gave me mostly drones. You got to ask what you like. I don't they, like they don't like to give off flats. They don't be having enough as you got off your sleep. Now see? But I got me some garlic parm wings, extra wet. And we're at Popeye's. They told me to get them a second so they could take my order. But the manager has already come out and said that I'm trespassed. Literally. 
I'm just sitting in the drive through. I ain't said nothing to him. My oldest son literally just came to Popeyes and ordered him some food after school, like he do often. I want the Buffalo Wild Wings and met him. Where he so that tell you it's nothing personal because her oldest son goes to Popeyes all the time and still order his food and they give him his food. Picked up my food. Mm -hmm. And the Popeyes to get Choices food. It ain't nothing about the family. Only for the manager to come out the back door and tell me. If you want to, you can stroll that red ball, stroll it forward in my live right now. And you can see what she did to get trespassed from Popeyes. I just went over the video like five minutes ago. I'm trespassed. I said, oh, really? What a trespass paper. I got one. I always got to do a call 911. Call him. <laughs> he know how it worked, don't he? I ain't cussed him out. I ain't did nothing to him. Call him. Yes, you did. Just a year. Call him. Let's see. That's the end of that one. So he said first pass from Popeyes. What about that? Hold on, y'all. Let me see. So Peach Patch, I'm literally still in line at Popeyes. I've been in line for 30 minutes. Look at this. The police still ain't came to serve me my trespass. They still ain't got back on this intercom to take my order. Instead, they're just peeking behind the counter, like hiding behind the looking. She just sitting there blocking the line. Let's see if I'm going to get out of line. Sure. Baby, I've been working on patience. I feel like God, sure. I'm going to remain patient. I'm going to wait on either them to take my order or for them to tell me I'm not allowed to order or for the police to come tell me. I am banned and I got to get out of line. After all that, why would you ever even order food to take it to your child to eat anyway? You didn't make these people mad, acted crazy, and you have blocked them from taking drive through orders for the past 30 minutes. Even if they take your order, you really going to feed it to your child? Hmm. So, yeah, we just waiting. Popeyes, we just waiting. I, I was trespassed. What a paperwork. What a paperwork. You see that they really did won't take my order. The police still ain't got here. I've been here for 30 minutes. I can't even get out of the car. So once again, I'm at Popeyes, the nasty Popeyes at that. They say trespass. They come out the back door telling people, oh, they can't take their order because somebody was trespassed. Well, what the police say? Ain't got a damn bit of paperwork saying I'm trespassed. This is a mess. I have not cussed at them today. Right? I'm waiting. I'm away. I have all the patience in the world. I'm not moving. They got to back up and they got to back up. I'm literally going to wait. Popeyes, I swear to God, I'm suing the fuck out of y'all. Watch. I'm mm -hmm. going to sue y'all, baby. This how y'all run y'all businesses. I'm suing y'all. And I'm waiting on the police because if I am trespassed, I need to see the paperwork. How y'all trespass me? Y'all don't even know my name. Oh, do y'all? Did y'all see yourself on social media? That's what it was. I got patience. I, I swear I have all the patience in the world when it comes to this matter. I'm going to sit here and I'm going to wait for one, the police to come and show me my paperwork that I'm trespassed for two, them to take my order or three, for them to tell me I'm not allowed to order here. They could, they could literally say, oh, you're not allowed to eat from here because basically that's what they are saying. I'm trespassed, but they ain't got a damn bit of paperwork. I've been sitting in this line now for about 42 minutes. I mean, 32 minutes. I got the patience. Baby, I swear I got the patience. Mm -mm. So, Peach Patch, I'm literally still in line at Popeye's. I've been in line. All right, y'all. The police finally pulled up. This is the boy that keep coming out saying hi. And as y'all hear, Woods calling also. Like, she just doing the whole most. They um trespass me and telling people that that's the reason. So we waiting on the police to come hand me my trespass paperwork. It is nasty. She's so damn smart. Remember, she said, I went to school. I'm smart. I read books. I could teach y'all everything, but she don't know it's fucking no paperwork included. Mm, God damn. God damn. She be talking about suing everybody. She don't know what the hell she's talking about. Child, she said she was going to sue me. Bitch, I, I emailed YouTube right back. Tell her, come on with it. I want to see this.
Girl, bye. So we sit in here. The sheriff just pulled in, so I'm gonna sit right here, and we gonna officially get me trespass from Popeyes. Mm. Or he gonna give, matter of fact, not officially get me trespass. He's gonna give me the stuff I'm already trespassed for. Cause remember, this boy said I'm already trespassed. So he said I'm trespassed from Popeyes. What about that? Well, the papers is nine one one. I call him. Call him. Call the or... police on me. Call the call the police on me. Nobody. Popeyes, I swear to God, I'm going to sue the fuck out of y'all. I swear to God. Watch. Watch. Oh Watch. All right, Peach Patch. So we have a nice sheriff deputy, and then we have the manager of Popeyes who told me that I'm already trespassed. Hi. Hello. Hi, Lo. The fuck? She nice and high. So, Peach Patch, I'm literally... All right, y'all. The police find... How are you doing today? I'm doing phenomenal, and you? Good. Um, I was just told by the employees here that you've been sitting here for an hour. No, he told me that I'm already trespassed. I have him on camera, so I said, "Where's the paperwork that I'm trespassed from here?" Okay, I can so, check for you. If please you like. do. Okay, what's your first name? My first name is Peaches, like the fruit. Uh, of I course, do. you can. Give me a moment. Okay. All right, Peach Patch. So we're gonna go officially get my paperwork because I'm. <laughs> you see, she asked for Peach ID. <laughs> After she said, my name is Peachy, it's like the fruit, she said, oh, okay, can I see your ID? Because, bitch, uh, 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 you already been sitting here for 45 minutes over ordering food. So we're already feeling that you're having a mental break. And now you didn't told me your name is Peachy, it's like the fruit. Just give me your ID. Just, just give me your ID. Would come get your wife, because this don't make no goddamn sense. I'm trespassed. Let me get her my ID. Hey, yo, nah. Officially. Popeyes, once again, I swear hey, to God, I'm going to sue the fuck out of y'all. I swear to God. Can I give you my gun permit? Look like I don't have my... Oh, I do have my ID. It's in this part of my purse. Um, oh, I don't. Let me give you my gun permit. Do you possess a driver's license? I do. You causing all this drama in the line forever and you don't even got your driver's license. Uh uh uh. This is a fucking mess. I just don't have it. My apologies. I might. How are you doing today? I'm doing phenomenal. And you? Good. So, Peach Patch, I gave the officer. Officer Miss Jean, right? Deputy Jean. Mm -hmm. Deputy M. Jean. I gave her my concealed weapons permit. Now, mind y'all, this man, I've been sitting here for over 40 minutes. They've refused to take my order. They say I'm already trespassed. He never came out. Now he want to be out all smiles. Let's keep this in mind, y'all. Let's keep it in mind. <laughs> <laughs> If a business doesn't want you there, unfortunately, we have to do a trespass. That's okay? fine, but he said I'm already trespassed. Yeah. Oh, okay. Don't okay. if I'm already trespassed, I go to jail. That is correct. Okay, and then in order to get trespassed, don't I have to have notice that I'm trespassed? I'm just a trespass me without ever telling me that I'm trespassed. No, you would have to have knowledge of it. So, the, so how a trespass works is if you're at a property and a business owner doesn't want you there, we would have to come out and respond, and then you would be notified of that right then and there. Mm -hmm. And then if you were to return after that warning, yes, you'd be subject to arrest. Okay. That's what I'll go check right now for you. Um, but just hang tight, okay? Thank you so much. So I'm going to wait because he said I'm already trespassed. So if I'm already trespassed. So she's still waiting, but the lady has told her that the way a trespass works is that if they decide they want you trespassed, that is what they do. And then the next time you come to the establishment, they notify you that you are trespassed and they call the police, which is what they did. They told her that she was trespassed. She is already trespassed from the property and she cannot place an order. She decided to stay there forever and ever for the police to come and tell her stupid ass the same thing. Child, bye. And the way he laughed was absolutely amazing. I love it because he completely just ate peach. Like, <laughs> homeboy ate down <laughs> a whole 45 minutes later. He ate down for a whole 45 minutes and he's still not full.
<laughs> you trespass. We're not taking your order, period, bitch. He was probably the one that cooked the chicken the first time. They got her trespass in the first place. Remember, she kept saying, you need to fire the cook. Fire the cook. He was probably the cook. Guess what, Peach? He didn't get fired and your ass can't place an order there. You got to send wood in there or you got to send your son to place an order from now on. You are a damn shame. And you're about to be trespassed from Walmart, too. This is wonderful, y'all. Fucking Thank wonderful. I've already been saying. I should be in handcuffs. I don't want to go to jail. I hope I don't go to jail. She's stupid. But we're going to see Popeyes. We're going to see. He said I'm already trespassed. He said it. I just don't have I got it on camera. You see how she only hear what she wants. I'm doing phenomenal. And you? Good. Um, so, Peach Patch, I gave the officer... I, I was trespassed. What a paperwork. What a paperwork. All right, Peach Patch, since I'm so passionate about this and we got to pick up the kids, my husband is taking the kids. I mean, going to get the kids. I switched to Gregory McKay's car. So, yeah, there's no formal trespass assessment on either. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know what the employee was talking about. But um, as of today, they do want you to trespass. That's fine. Okay. You can trespass So now. as of today, you are being trespassed, okay? okay? So if you return, you could be subject to arrest. That's fine. Okay. I don't need my paperwork, right? I get something that says that. No, we this document work? it in our system. It'll be a street check. Um, okay. But it's just a verbal warning, okay? All right. So she still don't get paperwork. Ciao. Bye. She still don't get paperwork. And now since she said that she wasn't trespassed and she waited 45 minutes in the drive through while blocking law on um, the line she is actually formally trespassed and she has been notified by the law enforcement oh my goodness peach mcintyre girl don't you get high on dick and pull up to popeyes and then forgot what's going on because you're going to jail the next time for sure all of that hoppity jobbity and all that talking and wasting time and Wood actually had to come up there in a whole different vehicle and get his vehicle to go get the kids. What'd that sound like? What'd that sound, what, what, what'd that sound like? Wood came up there in his, in the baby's, the kid's car to get his truck and left the kid's car with Peach. And she's still there talking to the police about not being able to place a damn order. Like, is that serious? Tell me, I, I'm passionate about this. Okay, Peach. All right. Okay, so what I mean, I, I don't understand. Yeah, like, this is a verbal warning. Me, uh, Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office deputy, tell you if you return to this Popeyes mm -hmm. at any time, you could be subject to arrest. Am I banned from all Popeyes or no, just, just this one, location? Just this one. And then just to co confirm, I wasn't previously trespassed. No. There's nothing in the system stating that. Right? No. Okay, thank you so much. So, Peach Patch, I am now officially trespassed from Popeyes. He lied. Popeyes, I'm suing the fuck out of y'all. She's so damn stupid. <laughs> Popeyes, I'm suing the fuck out of y'all. You, you dead serious right now? <laughs> what? Somebody in the comment section said getting banned from Popeyes is crazy work. Like, that's something Peach McIntyre would do. Only Peach McIntyre would go to Popeyes, be rejected to order, be notified multiple times that she is trespassed. Have the police actually called on her and then be formally fucking trespassed on camera and everything else. Like, it didn't say you're going to sue them. I don't even understand, girl. What in the hell? Chill by. I don't even... She says she going to sue them. Peach, let me be the first to tell you. That will be a unsuccessful suit, okay? You're not going to get a goddamn dime. You're not going to get far. You're not even going to get to the gates with that shit. Remember, everything is documented. You do remember this, right? Fuck. So they had valid reason to not want you back in their establishment. Even if you weren't formally notified that you were trespassed. They are an independently owned establishment. So the um, store manager can do what the fuck they decide they want to do. What, what is wrong with you? And then if you go to Popeye's again, it, it's, it's a big chance that the police come and they look in the system and still see that, oh, you're not trespassed. We don't see nothing. Because honestly, it sounds like it's just a mental note to be taken. What the heck? This is out of pocket. Mm -mm. 
he's gonna lose his job or he better girl bye so peach patch is currently 9 15 p.m child I hope you contacted your lawyer because you need to do a lawsuit on Popeyes. It'd be the dumb people in the comment section. Child, bye. Do you got a lawyer to contact? Tell me she need to sue Popeyes. So when she wastes her money trying to sue Popeyes and don't get shit, can she come and sue you? <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Peach, you said you're the smart one. Make the smart choice on this, okay? Girl, this is a fucking shame. Yes, she is a mess, y'all. A mess and a complete dang on joke. That is out of pocket. And if y'all didn't see what she did at Walmart, she gonna be trespassed from Walmart also. I just, I don't even feel like going back to that video. It's a lot, man. Let's see. I'm gonna find this Walmart video for y'all real quick. And then I'm gonna get up out of here. Y'all smack the likey like button. Thank y'all for joining me on this lovely Thursday, y'all already know there is a meet today, and we gotta do our thing, do our thing, sis, do our thing. Uh, where the video at? Where the video at? Where the video at? Look at her hair, y'all, child. And we was talking about that shirt, like y'all see, that's the third time she didn't wear this shirt, like four times in uh, one month. I don't know if it's a once a week uniform that she wear or what the hell is going on. Am I going back too far? I think I am. Why y'all tell me I'm going too far? I'm going the wrong way. I'm looking for the freaking Walmart video. Let's see if I can find it real quick. Y'all, how is everybody's? How is everyone's doing today? I'm having a wonderful day. It's been real laid back and kind of just chill for real. Where the heck is this video at? I've been laid back and chill, y'all. Jeez, I just watched the video. Where is it? It's right here somewhere. There it is. There it is, y'all. Okay, so this is what she had on in Walmart. Remember, I was like, she in here with no dang on clothes on. In here with no clothes on looking crazy. That's what she wore to Walmart, y'all. Child, she be embarrassing her. She be embarrassing that boy so bad. Forget Wood. It ain't about embarrassing him. She be embarrassing her oldest son and think it's cute. But this is what she did in Walmart. Omar, right? In line. She said that the registers automatically go off at 11. So, like, even though I've been standing in this line before 11, they registers automatically stop working at 11 and that she can't check my stuff out. I'm like, what? Like, what am I supposed to do? She said, I can't use self checkout. So, even though I've been in this line, <laughs> Y'all see how she in Walmart? <laughs> Look at her hair. Yo, she's in Walmart with that bodysuit thing on. We just seen her dancing in with her hair looking like this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. So check out. So even though I've been in this line, I have. Hey, toy, toy. No, I was already standing right here. I didn't just walk up. This is crazy. So she lying. They just cut the register off at 11. Just lying. Yeah, I'm just going to leave this stuff right here. I swear, every day I get tested. Every single fucking day I get tested. Every day. That's why I feel how ugly. Every day. I'm going to say... The registers automatically closed them. It's like, God, what do you want from me? Do you want me to save money? That had to be what it is. I so she's in Walmart with her hair looking a damn mess, intimidating the employees because she made sure she said fucking right by that little girl. As the little girl went past, she made sure she aggressively said that. Then walked past the other employee and told her her hair was ugly. She gonna be trespassed from Walmart also, as she should be, as she should be. 
I didn't need those picture frames. I came in here for some formula for my baby. And <laughs> every day I get tested. Y'all heard what she said. Just lying. Y'all heard what she Y'all, said. I'm just going to leave this stuff right here. I swear every day I get tested. Every single fucking day I get tested. Every day. That's why your hair ugly. Every day, fucking day, I get tested. Every day. That's why your hair ugly. Every day, fucking day, I get tested. <laughs> Every day. That's why your hair ugly. Every day. I'm gonna say the registers <laughs> automatically closed. It's like, God, what do you want for me? What? Do you want me to save money? That had to be what it is because I didn't need those picture frames. I Girl, came in here for God. some formula for my baby. And mm. every day I get tested. This will literally be my last time ever shopping at Walmart. <laughs> last time. I'm about to go to Walgreens. And get so every day I get tested. Every day I get tested. So understand, she did this in Walmart four days ago, eleven o'clock at night. She did this in Walmart four days ago. Told the lady her hair was ugly. <laughs> Recording outside the Walmart, talking about she ain't never shopping in Walmart again. And then three days after that, she got trespassed from the Popeyes. She said, "God really tested me." He just keep testing me. <laughs> Girl, I'm enjoying the test that he is dishing your way, and you fell in every last one of them. That's why your hair ugly. Girl, bye. You funny. Some formula. You funny. And get some water. <clears throat> and I won't lie, I'm pissed off. <clears throat> but I ain't even mad at her. I'm mad at me. This is why. She mad at Wood because he didn't go get that formula. Because why the hell are you out at 11 o'clock at night with your hair looking like that in your son's car trying to get formula? Where's Wood at? Mm -mm -mm. I don't need to shop at Walmart. I fucking hate Girl, Walmart for this particular reason. I don't even know where I parked at. Oh, right here. I'm at Gregory's car. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I am so mad. Woo. And I know that wasn't nice to sell that lady her hair ugly. <laughs> Especially with my hair look like this. I'm so mad. Let's go to Walgreens. Let's go to Walgreens. <laughs> 11 o'clock at night with my hair looking like this. Child, I don't even know what the hell they was thinking when Peach walked up. Like, this is a damn shame. And the lady said, no, you were standing over there. So if you were in the self-checkout and you already knew that it was goddamn 10, 50, 8 p.m., why did you leave that self-checkout and try to run over to the damn cashier so she can bag your shit up so you could be lazy? Now you can't get nothing checked out at all. Then you're going to tell the lady her hair ugly. Peach picture is about to be on that picture on the bulletin board. Do they still have the pictures on the board when you walk in Walmart? They're going to put Peach picture up there. Trespassed. Do not let her come in. Hell no. This is a freaking shame, y'all. It's a true embarrassment. She told that lady her hair was ugly. And then said every single day, God is testing her. <laughs> Girl, you failed that test. You, you told that lady somebody always fucking testing you every day. You failed. You walked past and told her her hair was ugly. You failed the damn test. You didn't fail. Up in Popeye's talking crazy. Goddamn stood and y'all, she blocked the Popeye's line for 45 minutes. Tell me she didn't fail the test. Y'all go tell her she's failing the test because she said the man above is testing her, but we need to let her know that her approach is failing. It is not working at all whatsoever. Y'all hit the likey like button on the way out. I was too done. I was not going live today, not this early. And I just turned on TikTok and here go Peach McIntyre inside the Walmart with her damn hair looking like that. I said, oh, yeah, this definitely a live moment. First bitch then got trespassed from the Popeyes the other day. I didn't even talk about it. But now she in Walmart looking a mess. We going to talk about it, okay? We didn't talk about it. Y'all are the real MVPs. Y'all been here for the entire time.
thank y'all for joining me. Y'all have a wonderful rest of your day. And I will talk to you in our next reaction video. Bye, y'all.